Chelsea Gray is one of those players that is a coach's dream. She's the floor general. She understands pace, she understands momentum, she understands how to execute, how to get the ball to the right people at the right time. But the other thing that's really special about Chelsea is that she's all about this team. Her IQ separates her because throughout the game, she'll say, hey, this is how they're defending pick and roll, this is how they're defending Asia, this is how they're defending me. And so she can see as the game progresses, are they gonna make adjustments, are they not? So at the end of the game, she'll know exactly what she's gonna see. And at the same time, she's got that closer DNA. I think she will go down in history as one of the best point guards in the WNBA just because of her ability to pass and see the floor. The way that she sees the development of the game, two, three steps ahead of, of what's happening, is really masterful. It's, it's like watching a master chess player. I just have a lot of respect for her approach and her as a human being. As a parent, you know, you kind of listen to your kids and see what direction they really want to, you know, pick up, and her pickup was basketball. She was wanting to be good, you know, and not so much as playing the game, but understanding the game and being able to relate to the game on the court, you know, and making everybody around her even better. It was just win, and that was the whole attitude. So the coach came to James and I and said, I just want to let you know, she's going places. She's going to be real good. I wanted to go somewhere that wasn't in California. I wanted a new, like, vibe. I wanted a new situation. I wanted to go somewhere that hasn't won before. I wanted to make that mark at a university, but I still wanted academics. That was important in my household. Oh, and no look pass. How about that ball to Greg to Peters, and then the finish. The injuries at Duke was very difficult because Chelsea's a baller. So anytime you, as a parent, you see your kid in pain, that also draws pain, you know, to you as well. She just did whatever it took for her to, you know, help Chelsea get through that process. And that process was very difficult because the mindset, you know, that Chelsea was having, you know, am I really going to get through this? I used to always try to take it to a spiritual level and tell Chelsea, God loves you. For some reason, he chose this to happen to you. It's a process, but it's okay. He's got something greater for you later. With the 11th pick in the 2014 WNBA draft, the Connecticut Sun select Chelsea Gray from Duke University. They called her name, number 11 for the draft. And Connecticut gave her that opportunity this has always been a dream of mine, and I always, I've always wanted to do this, and I just feel really blessed right now. They drafted me and understood that I wasn't going to play that season, that I had to sit out and really rehab my knee. Chelsea's tough. She would look at me and her mom and say, uh, you know, hey, you know, I just want to play. This is a player that Coach Joanne P. McCauley has likened her to Magic Johnson because of how she can make the players around her better. Behind the back pass, and it gets to Kelsey Ball. Peterson for Gray, a three. He's when gone. Chelsea called me, she said, Dad, I think I'm, I'm getting ready to get traded to LA. That excitement excited me by seeing her excited. I think from that gave Chelsea that second chance of seeing what she's capable of doing. And when LA came calling and, and she got that opportunity, she made the best of it. Chelsea Gray in her second year in the league, her first year in Los Angeles, showing what she can do once again here. The Sparks was a team that Chelsea learned a lot from the veterans there. And the group of girls that she was working with, Elena Beard, Candace Parker, they have made their mark in the game. But for Chelsea's standpoint, Chelsea wanted to, at some level, get to that mark. Rough and Pratt into Gray. She got it! Chelsea Gray firing daggers left and right. Chelsea's one of the best guards in the in the world, and 
for her to be able to be on that stage in 2016 and prove, you know, why she's there. And I think it's, you know, there's a story in adversity. I mean, everything hasn't come easy. She's had injuries. She had a couple of DNPs in 2016, and then she came in the finals game five and, you know, delivered, I think it was 10 or 12 straight points for us. Gray, tough shot, but she got it. Gray leans in, got another. Oh, she did it again. The LA Sparks have slain the Mighty Lynx. Winning a championship, holding up that trophy, like looking at the ring on your finger. So many people play in this league and do not have the opportunity to even play in the finals, but let alone like, win a championship. And with all of the off-season moves made by our aces, it looks like they will be lifting the city to a championship. One of these big moves includes signing three-time All-Star Chelsea Gray. When you want to win a championship, you want to be guided by somebody that's been there before. And when we signed her, it was huge because we needed that floor general on the court. We needed that guidance. You're getting down.